Syraki reveals Tanubu's 2023 presidential ambition reason for supporting Buhari Senate President Bukola Syraki has alleged that the national leader of the All Progressives Congress, Asawaju Bola Tanubu, is only supporting President Muhammadu Buhari's re-election with the hope of succeeding the president in 2023. Saraki made the allegation in a statement on Monday in response to an open letter written by Tanubu on Sunday. Tanubu in his letter, released late on Sunday, had said the Senate president dumped the APC because of his presidential ambition and selfish quest for power rather than good governance. But in a statement titled, The Tanubu Rhetoric My Response, the Senate President said when Tanubu was appointed the head of the APC's Reconciliation Committee, he, Tanubu, reached out to him and admitted that he was also not satisfied with Buhari's performance but he would remain in the party so that he, Tanubu, could emerge President in 2023. Saraki said Tanubu told him that he would support Buhari even if the President was on a stretcher. Iraqi added, however, during those meetings, the point of disagreement between me and him was that while I expressed my worry that there was nothing on the ground to assure me that the administrative style and attitude would change in the next four years in a manner that would enable us to deliver the positive changes we promised to our people, he, Tanubu, expressed a strong opinion that he would rather support a Buhari on the hospital stretcher to get a second term because in 2023 power will shift to the southwest. This Tanubu viewpoint was not only expressed to me but to several of my colleagues, so much for acting in national interest. It is clear that while my own decision is based on protecting collective, national interest, Tanubu will rather live with the identified inadequacies in the government for the sake of fulfilling and preserving his presidential ambition in 2023. This new position of Tanubu has only demonstrated inconsistency, particularly when one reviews his antecedent over the years. The Senate president said Tanubu was still sulking over the fact that he, Saraki, was one of those who opposed Tanubu's bid to emerge as the running mate of Buhari in 2014. Saraki said he had insisted that Buhari's running mate should be a Christian for the sake of balance, a decision which he said angered Tanubu. He added, again, let me reiterate my position that my uncertain and complex relationship with Tanubu has been continually defined by the event of 2014 when I and other leaders of the APC opposed the Muslim-Muslim ticket arrangement about to be foisted on the APC for the 2015 polls. It should be noted that he has not forgotten the fact that I took the bull by the horns and told him that in the interest of the country, he should accept the need for the party to present a balanced ticket for the 2015 general elections in terms of religion and geopolitical zones. Since that time he has been very active, plotting at every point to undermine me, within and outside the National Assembly. The Senate president said his decision to quit the APC was based on Buhari's disrespect for the legislative arm of government and his allies. He said the Buhari government expected the National Assembly to be a rubber stamp. Saraki said he even Tanubu had once criticized Buhari, but had decided to change his mind for selfish reasons. The Senate President said, I can also vividly recall that he himself always expressed his displeasure with the style of the government and also mentioned that he had equally suffered disrespect from the same government which we all worked to put in office. Saraki said Tanubu had been using his newspaper to malign his character and settle scores. He alleged that in one of such malicious stories, he, Saraki, was quoted to have said he would remain in the APC on the sole condition that he would be given an oil block and automatic ticket. The Senate president added, It is a surprise to me that Asawaju Tanubu is still peddling the falsehood about the fact that my defection is about automatic tickets and sharing of resources. Members of the public will recall that when the issue of my decision to quit the APC came to the fore and many APC leaders were holding meetings with me, a newspaper owned by the same Tanubu published the false report about the promise of automatic ticket, oil block and other benefits. I immediately rebutted their claims and categorically stated that I never discussed any such personal and pecuniary benefits with anybody. 
My challenge that anybody who has contrary facts should come forward with them still remains open. I have what it takes to contest against Buhari, Tambu Wal tells Tanubu also on Monday. The Sokoto state governor, Al Haji Aminu Tambu Wal, responded to the allegations against him by Tanubu. Tanubu had also on Sunday alleged that Tambu Wal left the APC because the party refused to grant his demand for automatic ticket in 2019. But responding on the Twitter handle of the Sokoto state government, Tambu Wal denied that he defected from the APC because he was not given automatic ticket. He wrote, If I wanted to, I could contest against President Buhari under the APC. I have what it takes to have contested against Mr. President, I adduced reasons of my defection to the PDP. The reasons are still on record. Automatic ticket by the APC is certainly not part of that. Quote, the governor said he had given the people of Sokoto State the reasons he defected and automatic ticket was not among. He stated, Tanubu is confessing that there is no level playing field for all members of the APC, that there is no internal democracy in it and that some people were denied their right to internal democracy. Tanubu tried to rock the boat when he was denied Buhari's vice presidency. He thinks every other person could behave his way. If I wanted to contest under the APC as president, I could have done so and only the votes could have produced a winner. Think your friend would be INTRESTED. Share this story using any of the share button below down arrow place your text advert below. Greater than 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 loading. Share your story with US via email. Info at 247 Nigeria News Update.co Received news via our WhatsApp. Kindly text to 134,701056-0394 to add you. Click here to join us on our YouTube channel for news update. Click here to join us on Twitter for instant news update at 247NGNEWSUPDAT. Click here to join millions around the globe to read news on our Facebook fan page for instant updates on Instagram. Click here receive instant news update via our BBM broadcast D3DEFDF.